Hey guys, just a quick video on distinguishing between path line, streak line, and streamline, and we're going to establish how to find the equation of a streamline. So first, path line, that's defined as the path uh, a fluid particle follows. So if we look at a point A and B, it's simply the path that the fluid particle takes between them. Streak line, if a color dye was continuously injected at a fixed location, it would leave a streak line. So this uh, becomes important when you're dealing with fluids experimentally, but for now it's kept quite simple. Um, and finally, streamlines are lines that are tangent to the velocity at all points. Um, so these are all the same, only for steady flows. So later on in, in the course, uh, we're going to be looking at, in, in some problems, we're, we'll be looking at unsteady flows. Uh, in these cases, streamline, streak line, and path line are not all the same. Uh, but in the majority of examples, they will be the same. So when you're finding the equation of a streamline, you're in effect finding the equation of the path line and streak line. Now, by definition, uh, the streamline is the tangent to the velocity u. So if we have a velocity field equal to uh, ui plus vj plus wk, um, the streamline is the tangent at all points. Um, and we can find the equation of the streamline by finding the gradient of the velocity. So if we look at tan theta being the gradient of v on u rise over run uh, equal to dy on dx. So that's for a two-dimensional flow, um, which means our w would equal to zero and our velocity field would reduce to a 2D flow. Uh, now to find the equation of the streamline, all we do is integrate this and take different values for the constant of integration, which will give us a range of results. So we integrate dy and dx. You're usually given the velocity field, in which case you can integrate that. Um, and we'll get an equation for y in terms of x.